Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming at you barefaced. All I have on is moisturizer with SPF in it and some eye cream. And the reason I am barefaced is because I'm bringing you guys on an adventure with me. We are going shopping at Sephora inside JCPenney and we are looking for a new foundation and a new primer. So if you know me, you know that personally I love full coverage matte finishes and I also love a good hydrating primer and a pore blurring primer. So today we are going on the hunt for exactly that. The reason that I prefer a full coverage matte finish is because I am a little bit oily on the t-zone so I like to control that by wearing a matte foundation and I also like to cover up all of my acne scars that I have on my cheeks and also this cute little breakout that I just got. So I just want to let you guys know that that is what my personal preference is. That's what works for me. I know that other people like full coverage, dewy, glowy finish or a very very natural finish but personally when I put makeup on I just want to get rid of my tiny little acne scars and sometimes breakouts and I also want something that matches my skin perfectly so thankfully at Sephora inside JCPenney they will be color IQ matching me if you don't know what that is someone will help match you to the perfect foundation shade that goes to your face and body I don't really know what the process intakes but you are going to find out with me so when you go to Sephora inside JCPenney you will already know what's going to happen and you will have a little bit of background knowledge on this so we are going to go get color IQ match get a new foundation get a new primer and then we are going to put it all on our face and see how it looks how it works and does all of that but today I am treating myself and I'm also treating you guys because as I always say without you I would be nothing without you I wouldn't be where I am today I wouldn't be who I am today and I wouldn't be working with the companies that I am so blessed to work with today so to thank you guys to pay it forward to to show you guys that I appreciate you so much I will be giving away a $50 gift card to Sephora inside JCPenney so that you guys can go get color IQ match and get your perfect new foundation so without further ado I know that you guys want to get into the process as much as I do so I'll meet you at Starbucks and then we will go to Sephora inside JCPenney good morning may I help you Hi, can I get a venti mango dragon drink? Add three pumps of white mocha and then no dragon berries but add blackberries. We're gonna do the skin IQ just to find out for sure what your skin type is so we're putting you in the right kind of foundation, okay? Okay, perfect. Go right in here and we'll just hold it to your cheek. And then when it beeps, that's so your skin IQ is 59 so you're right in the normal range which is awesome for Colorado and beneficial with your moisturizer so you're probably using the oh, right moisturizer yes. for your skin. So we're gonna do three different parts you have nothing on your skin right I'm gonna get your shirt uh, out of the way. Yeah. Perfect. So we're gonna go down on your chin. Yeah. On your forehead. Your lashes look good. Oh thank you. <laughs> All right, so it takes the three shades and makes it into a perfect shade. Oh, cool. Can I watch you punch? Yeah, absolutely. So your shade is 1R08. So we'll hit the foundation. And it's nice because it'll do lip concealer everything for oh, you. Oh, cool. So these are all the ones that we carry in store and online that'll match you through Sephora. So it did pull Huda, which is perfect. One on there. Yeah. If you want to try that one, I feel like you like that one because it's not super drying either. It's good for okay. normal skin. Perfect. Okay, so you can press this into your skin. I love it. It smells like vitamin C. Yeah, that smells really good. <laughs> I'm like, and you can wear it alone too. Oh, cool. right now for Huda. Gonna put it right over here. This one works really good with this one. Just okay. Depending on preference. Okay. That's usually what I play with. Yeah. What oh. do you think about the shade? Um, it looks pretty good. Yeah. No, it's nice. The color cute takes like the guesswork out. Yeah. Is my pressure okay? Yeah, okay. that's fine. And we 
are home. I came home with a lot of goodies from Sephora inside JCPenney. Love that for me. So I basically went in, as I said, to find a full coverage matte foundation and a primer to pair it with that will make my complexion and my skin and face look flawless. So while I was there, I invested a little bit more into skincare and all of that because I truly believe that any makeup will look good on your face regardless if you know how to prep and prime your skin so i am so thankful that i was able to get color matched and i think the color iq process was really fun really easy and fast and we got the perfect foundation shade for my face which has always been a struggle and something super hard like going into the store and just like guessing what shade you are because i usually have to mix two foundations together and or two foundation shades together to create my own perfect color so color iq match process is amazing super fast you're literally in and out you go in you get color IQ match which takes no more than five minutes I would say and then it pops up with your shade of concealers your shade of foundation anything that you would need for your complexion it pulls up by getting your color IQ number so I'm super thankful for that and now I'm gonna show you guys how the primer and foundation look on but before that I'm going to prep my skin to prep my skin I'm going in with the Ula Henriksen truth C rush brightening gel cream which is just a facial moisturizer and it has three sources of vitamin C and a rose of winter extract so we're going to go ahead and prep our skin with this as much as I like to moisturize my face I also like to moisturize my under eyes so I'm going to go in with a little bit of eye cream from Ula Henriksen as well this is just the banana bright eye cream And as I let that set in, I also got a sleeping mask for my lips because my lips have been really dry. So this is what the sleeping mask is. My mom has this and she loves it, so I decided to go ahead and give it a try. And I know it's a, it's a sleeping mask, it's like for the night, but we need it right now. And now for the part that we've been waiting for, the fun part, the foundation and primer part. So. I also went ahead and picked up the Ula Henriksen primer, which is the primer that the girl used at Sephora inside JCPenney um, to prep my skin before the foundation, before she tested the foundation on me. So I just got the Banana Bright Face Primer. And this one has the vitamin C banana powder inspired pigments and you can wear this by itself just on a no makeup day or you can it's perfect for under makeup as well. So we'll go ahead and do this. She told me to get a good finish i need to like press it in not necessarily rub now going into the foundation the one that i picked out was the huda beauty faux filter foundation and i color match to the shade toasted coconut 240n and i'm going to use a damp beauty sponge i did about two pumps on the back of my hand and i like to put it on my hand first and use my finger to sort of start putting it on my face and i work in sections just so i know that i blend it in really well am i here pretending to be like a super professional beauty guru <laughs> Okay guys, so I just put a little bit of eyebrows on and I just wanted to show you the finish of the foundation. It is perfect color for my skin and I really love the finish. I have not set it, I have not put concealer, no other product on top of it and I love it. It really is a soft matte full coverage finish. Like I don't look dried out, I don't look flaky, cakey, none of that. Everything that I wanted to be covered is covered and I just love the performance of it on top of the primer as well. Okay, so my whole makeup is on now. This is basically my everyday makeup and the foundation looks flawless. The primer looks really, really good. My pores are pretty much blurred and I honestly think overall the finish of my skin looks really good and 
definitely my color because there's no lines nothing if you see a little bit of darkness down here i just put a little bit of bronzer because we gotta snatch our jawline um but that's pretty much it so if you stayed to the end of the video you guys know as i said at the beginning i will be giving away a gift card to sephora inside jc penny and it is going to be worth 50 dollars. so you guys can go get your color iq match and get your color iq number so you can see what foundation best fits you and you can get your perfect foundation shade all you have to do for this giveaway is make sure that you are subscribed to my youtube channel like this video and comment down below what your favorite foundation finish is and that's really it it's super easy and simple but in case you forget and you want more details everything will be in the description below as well as a link to the products that i used today so that is it for today's video thank you so much to sephora inside juicy penny for sponsoring this video i'm truly thankful truly blessed and i could not express my gratitude enough that's why i always wear this necklace that is like an upside down half triangle that basically means gratitude because i will always be grateful for the companies i work with and for you guys because without you this wouldn't be possible so thank you guys so much for watching i love you so much i appreciate you so so much and i will see you in my next video but until then please always remember god goes glowing and growing